Today's story is Otter Be Helpful. Otter Be watched raindrops make little rivers down the windows. Rain pitter pattered in puddles outside. He loved sliding and splashing in the water, but today the weather was cold. He decided to play indoors instead. Otterby dumped out his blocks and built a pretend forest with tall trees and a winding creek. Then he drew pictures of all his friends. After that, he made a tent with a blanket and piled up a bunch of pillows, like a nest. He crawled inside and read books to his stuffed animals. Goodness, said Mama. Grammy and Papa are coming for lunch and this place is a mess. Otterby peeked out from his tent. Books and blocks, paper and crayons, blankets and stuffed animals cover the floor. He looked up at Mama with big eyes. I can help put your books away, she offered. Otterby scrambled over to his block forest. I'll cut down my forest and stack the blocks back in the bin. Let's make a game. Mama and Otterby raced to see who could finish first. Then they lined up the stuffed animals from tallest to smallest. They folded the blanket together and Otterby put it back on the chair. Then they had a pillow fight. That was fun, Otterby giggled. Thanks for helping me. Mama looked at the clock. Oh, I need to fix lunch. Maybe I can help you now, Otterby suggested. Mama gave Otterby four forks and four napkins. He placed a napkin next to everyone's plate and then put a fork on top of each napkin. What's next, he asked. Mama let Otterby stand on a stool and watch tiny tomatoes and baby carrots for a salad while she tore lettuce leaves into small pieces. They mixed all the vegetables together in a big bowl. Then Otterby poured some of his favorite fishy crackers in a basket. I know another way I can help, said Otterby. He tore a sheet of paper into four pieces. He colored one pink, one blue, one green, and one brown. Then he put one on each plate. Ding dong, the doorbell rang. Grammy and Papa had arrived. Come, see the table, said Otterby as Mama invited them in. As he bounded around the table, Otterby pointed to the colored papers he'd made. Papa, you sit at the brown place because that's the color of your favorite hat, he said. Grammy, your place is pink because that's your favorite color. Mama, yours is green because you grow tasty things in the garden. And my place is blue because water is blue and I love it. They all sat down at their special places and started eating. This salad is delicious, said Grammy. As Papa crunched into a cracker, he looked around and said, The room is so neat and tidy. You two have been working hard this morning. Mama winked at Otterby. Work is fun when you have a helper, right, Otterby? Otterby nodded. His mouth was full of crackers. There's always lots of work to do in every family. God says that helping out is best. It's how you Otterby. The Bible says, let us not become tired of doing good. Galatians 6, 9.